Hi there. Uh, sorry, it's me again. So when I started to play with my Arduino Sigfox card, they were asking at some point two key information, which was the ID and the pack ID. And I had no idea where I could find them out. So I directly wrote to the people who actually sold me the card and said, hey, uh, you missed to send me actually the ID and the pack ID in order to register my uh, Arduino Sixbox card to the network. And they told me that actually the ID are within the card itself and you need for that to play a program which is exactly the same as the one uh, which uh, somehow put in deep sleep my uh, my card and which was the subject of another uh, video that I shot uh, previously. So in order to get this ID and this pack ID, you will need to copy and paste uh, the code which is here, okay? But the problem is, as I previously said in a previous video, when I copy and pasted this, it put my Arduino card within a deep sleep mode. So what I did this time is I just copy and paste all these parts just before the send the module to the deepest sleep. Because what happened is the first time when I read the tutorial, I stopped myself right here and it seems that actually this part is putting the Arduino card within deep sleep or, or at least something similar but in any case I didn't want to copy and paste this stuff again uh, as actually it put myself into like um, deep trouble during weeks because I didn't understand actually how I could uh, get an access back to my card. So what I did this time and this is the reason why I'm shooting this video is I just copy and paste so this code up to here, up to the delay uh, 100, so exactly like like up here, right? I then close it here, and I do not even mention something within the loop, and then I click on upload. When I clicked on upload, I got like an error message telling me that in order to do that, I should first uh, reset my card, so you have like a small button on your card when you have like three letters it's written rst which stands for reset you just need to plug it once and then it will disconnect your arduino card from your computer and then we'll connect it back to your computer and then you can push here on upload and then you can click on monitor i'm not going to click on monitor right now because it's going to show actually my id and my pack id and i guess that those two id are personal for your card and you should not uh, leave them to some other people, I guess. So that's why I'm not disclosing it. But if I click here on monitor, you will definitely see the ID and the pack ID, which are within your cards. And that, of course, are not provided by uh, the constructor, as I taught at the beginning. So I really hope that this small, tiny video will really help you out of finding this ID and pack ID in order for you to start on the Sixbox network. Thanks for watching.